Let's learn how to use Strux style and terrain tools. We'll cover all the basics you need to start creating awesome game environments and bring your vision to life. To get started, go to the build section. Then you can either open one of your drafts, choose one of the templates, or create a new game from scratch. Once you're in, hit the button at the top to access the style and terrain editor menus where you'll find all the tools to build and customize your environment. Let's start off with the style menu. The first button gives you a ton of style presets to choose from. These include textures, sounds, and weather and allow you to completely change the look of your game with the press of a button. Choose the one that best suits the game you're creating. The textures button allows you to customize the texture on top of your terrain as well as the texture on the sides of high terrain. The water menu lets you add water to your environment, modify the look of it, or even replace it with lava or acid. Adjust the water level by simply moving the slider left or right. To set the mood of your game, head to the lighting setting. You can pick from a range of light and ambient colors, as well as adjust the intensity of the light. Don't be afraid to experiment until you find the best fit for the atmosphere you want to create in your game. And of course, we can't forget about the weather. Tapping on the weather button will bring up a menu that lets you choose from different sky styles, from clear blue skies to warm sunsets or even dark and mysterious galaxies. You can also change the weather conditions by making it rain, snow or by adding sandstorms and you can change the background sound to fit your game's mood. Finally, in the settings menu, you have the option to further enhance your environment by adding fog and adjusting its intensity. Here, you can also modify the gravity to replicate the environment that you want. For example, if you're making a game set on a different planet, lowering the gravity will allow your characters to bounce around like they're on an alien world. Combining all the settings in the style menu lets you create the perfect atmosphere for your game. So whether you want a beautiful lush environment, a scorching desert, a fantasy world, or a dark horror game, the style menu allows you to bring your vision to life with just the tap of a few buttons. Now let's get into the terrain editor. At the top, you'll see a menu that includes all the brushes that will help you modify the shape of your terrain, the shape of your brush, as well as a settings menu where you can adjust the size and strength of your brush. Let's start off by creating some basic environment shapes. To raise the terrain, select this brush and tap and hold while moving your finger on the screen. If you want to lower it, you can do the same with this brush. You can also go into the brush settings and increase the size and strength for a more dramatic effect, which is really useful when you want to create hills and mountains. To smooth out the terrain, select this brush and drag your finger across the area until you're happy with the result. Use the leveling brush to level out areas of your terrain. Just tap on the spot where the terrain height is right and drag your finger across to bring everything to that same level and make the terrain flat. Add more interest to your terrain by using this irregular brush that helps you achieve a more organic look. You can go back and forth into the settings to adjust the height of your terrain. Increase it to make the mountains much taller or bring it back down to make them shorter and more smooth. From the settings menu, you can also remove the terrain completely, which is really useful when you're creating parkour games. Or if for some reason you want all your characters to plummet into the void. <coughs> Otherwise, while you create your environment, you can go back and forth between the style and terrain editors to tweak things until you nail it. That's it, you're now a terrain editing pro. Use all these tools and features to create awesome environments for your characters to explore. Have fun and we can't wait to see what you come up with.